The Meow Mare used to be one of Terraria's best melee weapons, until it got replaced by the Zenith in the, one of the most recent updates. In today's video, I'll be taking it through a DPS test, fighting the Moonlord Pillars, and even the Martian Invasion to figure out if the Meow Mare is still worth getting. If you like these types of videos, please consider subscribing, and without further ado, let's hop right into the video. Anyways, now it's time to take a look at how the Meow Mare does in a DPS test, and first off we're gonna go single target and these numbers that are like 6,000 are already impressive with our end game loadout like just take a look at that that is crazy and let's compare it to something like the solar eruption yeah the meow mare takes the cake easily still better all right now let's take a look at crowd control so the Meow Mare's bolt pierces up to five enemies, or hits up to five enemies. And along with the Meow Mare, just being there, gives us a solid 23,000 damage per second. Which is absolutely crazy, but expected from an endgame weapon. Next up, we're gonna fight the Moonlord and Martian, and the Martian Invasion, because I want to see just how good the Meow Mare is at crowd control and at boss fighting. Let's hop right into it. This weapon was so good that I didn't even realize I was taking down the Vortex Pillar, and it just happened. Alright, now it's time to take a look at some serious DPS. Getting a solid 6,000 on a single pillar. That was absolutely crazy. So the Meow Mare absolutely obliterated the pillars. The bouncing cats made it so the pillar enemies didn't even stand a chance, and now it's time to fight the Moon Lord. You know, first off, I'm gonna say I feel like it, it would benefit from homing. That would be something that would make this weapon even better, but alright, let's get to it. And we already have one hand out of the picture. With another hand following close second. And now, the main hand is out, or the core is out. And now we can just face tank. And he's dead. Alright, now that we've beat Moonlord, we're gonna move on to the Martian Invasion, because I wanna see how the Meow Mare does against multiple targets. So now the Martians are invading, so let's take a look at how it does against the martians you already know i'm doing this to farm for the zenith but like come on guys so i'm not really even seeing martians on my screen it's just their their remains that are coming to my screen so we've already cleared 50 percent of the invasion and we're on to martian saucers this is all we're on to So we already killed it, that was pretty quick. Now one thing to note is that it's not as efficient as something like the, the Star Wrath. But it did get the job done. Alright and we got the Influx Waver, let's go. So I think it's safe to say that this web's weapon is absolutely crazy for farming out invasions. At the end of the day, I would say that the Meow Mare is almost the perfect melee weapon, only topped by the Zenith. The Meow Mare is the best weapon that you could have for farming for the Zenith, and I think that it's definitely a weapon you should go for. Make sure to let me know your thoughts and opinions on the Meow Mare in the comment section, like, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next one.